Hey, so I have exciting news. You know, my husband Cody, you saw him on the potty training video. I'll link it right here. So you met him already and he is multi-talented. So he comes up with songs and jingles all the time. He is an excellent communicator. And now I'm so excited to share with you that he wrote and is publishing a children's board book. And this is just like a little sample copy of the front cover and I'll show some more slides of what the inside looks like in a minute. Hey, I'm Adrian, a pediatric speech language pathologist and you know that I love helping children communicate clearly, listen well, and gain life skills for their future. And I love children's books because they help us bond with our children, spend time together, create memories. It helps us to be a model of really great language skills and it models literacy skills for when they start to read to themselves. Cody's story has a lot of depth to it and it's a relatable story about life's first day experiences. You know, you have your first day coming up and you start to feel a little bit nervous about something happening like starting a new job, moving, going to school for the first time, losing your first tooth. There's so many first day experiences that we all have and this book really captures that feeling of feeling a little bit uncertain but then knowing that you have the support of your parent or grandparent who always has your back and this book just is illustrated so sweetly and I'm so excited to let you in on the backstory about this story. Okay so rewind almost a decade ago on January 4th 2013 I was just about to start my very first speech therapy job right out of grad school at the school for the blind in our state. Cody and I had only been dating for one week and he wrote me this super encouraging poem called The First Day and it was actually a sonnet and it was such an encouragement to me. It rhymed and it like took me through the first day experience and like all the emotions I was feeling of nervousness but then also it was an encouragement because he shared like what this job meant to other people like the students that I was going to serve and how I was going to learn so much from them and it just was such a sweet encouragement to me as I was feeling really nervous and anticipating what to expect um, and not really feeling super sure of myself as a new speech therapist. This is what the original poem looked like and over the years we've given that poem back and forth to each other. I put it in like a little page protector and anytime we've had a first day coming up we like to give the poem to each other and read it because somehow it just like applies to every single scenario in different and new ways. So we were just like this poem applies to everything. This is amazing how you wrote it so long ago but it's still relevant and true to all of our first day experiences. So he gave the poem to me again before the first day of launching my Learn with Adrian YouTube channel in 2015 and then before launching my sign language class in 2016 and before launching my class to help toddlers learn how to go from zero words to talking in phrases and sentences. All of those new first day experiences where I'm like really excited but also kind of feeling nervous and unsure. This poem applied to all of them. So then I would give it to Cody before he had a job interview in 2016, before we adopted our son in 2019, then before giving birth to our son in 2020, and then we gave the poem to each other on the like before our sons met each other for the first time in 2020, and then also before we moved in 2021, and then before my husband had a big presentation in 2022, and then we read it to our sons before they started their first little day of morning, Tuesday, Thursday, Mother's Day out just recently. And the poem is unique because just it applies to all those situations and encouraged us each in different ways every time we read it. We knew how encouraging this poem had been in our lives and we knew it would be an encouragement to other families too. So we had the idea to create a children's book that was fully illustrated to bring this relatable poem to life in a way that can be held and flipped through and cherished as a children's board book. Over the summer, Cody transformed the poem into a children's book called The First Day. We had it illustrated and it's been picked up by a publisher and is on track to be published next year in April of 2023, if we reach the Kickstarter goal. As a keepsake board book, it's going to be the perfect gift for expectant or new parents and also parents with young children who are having lots of those first day experiences. This would also be such a great book for grandparents to give to their grandchildren and to read to them as well. If you'd like to have this book on your bookshelf for your children 
or if you'd like to give it as a gift to your grandchildren or a friend of yours who is expecting a baby or a baby shower gift, we have decided to do a pre-order for friends and family and for you through Kickstarter for just 27 days. If it does hit the goal in 27 days, then that signals to the publisher that there is a demand for the book and then the publisher will print it and the book will move forward out into the world in April of 2023. So far, the Kickstarter already has a ton of momentum. It's already at 20% of the goal with a lot of people starting to back it and share it with their friends. So I would love to invite you to be a part of it. As a part of the Kickstarter, there is an option to participate in a way that gives to adoptive families. So you would be getting a book and you would be giving a book to a family who has been matched with a child for adoption. Since this Kickstarter already has so much momentum, I'm so excited to share it with you. And I wanted to let you know too that if this Kickstarter goes over the goal that we've set, we've established that 75% of the funds that exceed the goal will go directly towards an adoption grant agency called Show Hope that makes adoption more financially accessible to families. And the remaining 25% will be used to further market the book in a community near you. So I'd love to invite you to pre-order a copy of this sweet, sweet book. And once you click the Kickstarter link, you can scroll down and read more about the story and see a preview of several of the pages of the story. Then you'll be looking for a green button that says back this project and you'll click that button and you'll have some options of how you'd like to back the project. And if you connect with the story, I'd love to invite you to consider sharing by clicking copy and sharing the Kickstarter a link with someone who you think would be encouraged by the story. Also, copying and sharing the link on social media would be a wonderful way to share the story too. You can also click share on this video and share it that way. Thanks for joining us in our excitement about bringing encouragement to families around the world through this book. There's just 27 days left to pre-order this book. In the comments below, let me know if you've pre-ordered it and if you're going to have it on your bookshelf for your child or if you're planning on giving one as a gift or if you're getting several and you plan on doing baby shower gifts. I would love to know where this book is going to live. Whose bookshelf is this going to be on around the world? And maybe even let me know where you're from. I would love to see like the reach of this book in the future come April 2023. Thank you so much for watching to the end of this video. I'm really thankful for you and I'm just so proud of my husband and very excited to share all the work that he's put into this. And yeah, just so excited to share this with y'all. I hope you're having a great day wherever you are in the world.